Welcome back, you're watching Headlines Now. Now, the Commonwealth Games village, which has been heaped with criticism by foreign officials, opened today for the athletes. As many as 16 out of the 34 towers are said to be in an unlivable condition. The Delhi government has now been asked to take over the village from the city's top plan development body, the DDA. Chief Minister Sheeta Dixit visited the village today. The president of the Commonwealth Games Federation, Michael Fennell, arrived in the capital as well. Now, he is currently meeting the Prime Minister. High on his agenda is a first-hand review of the state of the village and other one news. Fennell had written to the Cabinet Secretary just two days ago. And the meeting, as we tell you, is presently going on on 7 Racecourse Road in Delhi. The treasurer of the organizing committee was apologetic as he answered the trail of questions on the Commonwealth disasters. Uh, let's listen into what he had to say. I is the entire setup of for these games, whether the organizing committee, government of Delhi, DDA, Sports Authority of India, CPWD, right. the NDMC, I mean, is is the effort put in by all these agencies is it negated by these incidents? We are, I genuinely feel sorry for whatever has happened and would like to apologize not only on my, our part, or part of the organizing committee, but everybody else connected. It is a, if these things have happened, these are, this is a collective failure. Well, now, what's the whole ruckus about? Uh, do you really think the media is going overboard uh, with all the criticism with the Commonwealth Games? Well, not exactly, because uh, every single day, with every single passing day, in fact, comes new surprises, most of them unpleasant. The latest one, of course, is the pictures coming out of the Commonwealth Games village. Now, this village uh, on your screens is uh, supposed to be one of international quality, housing uh, all the athletes who come from all Commonwealth nations. But have a look at all this. Dogs uh, on top of the bed, many of them, uh, of course, and these are very familiar sites. Haven't you seen them everywhere? Barn stains, uh, uh, wash basins being treated as spittoons, and that's what a normal toilet in a room in the Commonwealth uh, Village looks like. Labourers have, uh, of course, defecated and uh, spit barn everywhere, all over the place. Some works, like even construction of balconies, are incomplete. Debris is lying all over the place, a perfect breeding ground for mosquitoes. Now, look at that. Even uh, the paint off the wall seems to be coming off an open drain right next to the village, a breeding ground from mosquitoes, especially for a city like Delhi, which is reeling under a dengue menace right now. All this, of course, comes as a major embarrassment for the Commonwealth uh, Games uh, Organizing Committee, which is currently meeting the Prime Minister. Time for us to slip into a very short breakup. On the other side, we give you a first look into Rehman's CWG tune. That's coming up next. Stay with us.